Hi guys, this is Susie uh, from Our Divine Romance and Remedy for Mundane, and you are with Focus One Media. Yes, actually, I make it a habit. I mean, to me, if I don't share God in a performance, the performance is meaningless. So, I make it a habit, you know, whatever I've been like, maybe reading in the Bible that week or something, or just gotta put something on my heart to do or say while I perform, um, I'll just go ahead and do that. So, I'll just make sure to really pray and seek God a lot before a show. I mean, even every day, even if I'm not playing a show, it's just really important. Um, I think it'll be awesome. Like, I know this venue has had Christian bands before. Um, I think it's great because it's local bands and um, also, you know, people can talk to the band members of these local bands. You know, I believe that um, the, the gospel of Christ is shared more off the stage than on the stage because, you know, just the way we live and how we speak and our actions um, are most important. So, um, I think it'll impact, you know, kids a lot seeing that there's other kids in the area that, that, that are their age that um, are going to come and play music for God that has uh, music with a purpose. So I, I'm hoping, I'm praying it'll impact. Um, you know, we've had people come up and talk to us and just like say, hey, you know, what you really said just like touched my life, you know. And that's, this is awesome. Like I've had people like come up crying to me, you know, and that's all God right there is God just touches them, you know, uh, through the music or through the words, you know. Um, so yeah, I've seen people just like, uh, I remember we were trying out for this talent show in Remedy for Mundane and um, uh, we were just sharing God, you know, like usual and this lady just came up crying and she was just like, oh, what y'all did just bless me so much and stuff. And so it's been really great. Um, I haven't played at the Rabbit enough to really see that yet, but you know, hey, I'm hoping, you know, with God's blessing that'll happen. I would really actually love to get a recording of my acoustic stuff. Um, I don't know, God's just been opening the doors a lot for it lately, so I'm really looking forward to, you know, actually maybe getting other band members and making it more of a full band instead of just acoustic. Uh, yeah, I mean, just, just that, like, what's really cool is that with CDs, you can, after the shows, you can just go ahead and give them out um, to people, give out CDs, and, like, it brings the spirit home with them, so it's really cool, and just, it's able to, you know, the CD helps minister to kids at home too, so through the music. So I hope to get some recordings down, that would be cool. If your music doesn't have a mission behind it, you know, it can easily fall apart. So um, just to any of the other band members out there who have a band, you know, that is Christian, you know, just make sure that God stays the center of your band um, because, you know, God says that what He puts together, you know, no man can take apart and what he takes apart no man can put back together so you know just keep God the center and make sure to really pray and uh, make sure you're growing with your band members too you know because um, if you're not growing then that's no good you know how can you lead other people if you're not growing yourself you know so um, just encouragement for other band members out there and uh, just to keep praying that God uses your gifts in ways unimaginable that you never really expected so just be open to whatever God has for you